12 News goes inside Marquette University's COVID response plan. Students return to campus starting tomorrow with in-person classes beginning Wednesday. 12 News Nick Bohr is live at 16th in Wisconsin. Nick University leaders say they are ready to put their COVID plan to the test. Right, Joyce, ready or not, uh, the students returning here, the residents coming back this weekend and how long they'll be able to stay here will depend on how well they're able to follow those rules in place. Marquette students are returning to the same campus, but a different experience. It's exciting to have some energy back on campus and to welcome everybody back. MU will have about 60% of classes in person, keeping students spread out and adding technology, including smart podiums. So that those classes that are delivered in a hybrid format have the ability to both stream and be in person. Even as they're just arriving, though, students are wondering how long it'll last. If you look at the cases, new cases, it's like increasing at alarming rate, right? So, of course, a little bit concerned. Feeling a little anxious about it because nobody's being tested when they come back to campus and stuff. So, and there's a lot of parties going on and stuff. So, I don't know. I hope they're taking it seriously. It's true. Although the furniture in the dorm rooms is spread out and with fewer residents than before, unlike at UW Madison, residents at Marquette won't be required to get COVID tests. Uh, the medical clinic and the city of Milwaukee Public Health Department has really focused on testing symptomatic students and not asymptomatic. The dining halls have a different look, no self-service and limited seating. But as the VP of Student Affairs here points out, this is all secondary to making sure the classes work. Our primary focus here is our academic delivery. And so just as long as our students have a place to live and learn and sleep and eat these basic needs, that's what this experience is about. And that's what we're giving them at Marquette. This has forced everybody to just rethink how to get things done. Nick, Marquette is asking students to do a daily health screening and get a test if they have symptoms. So how will they handle positive tests? Right. Well, they have set aside about 100 isolation slash quarantine rooms uh, scattered around the campus here with private bathrooms. They'll have food delivery there as well. And they tell me that they've even contracted with a nearby hotel here if that doesn't prove to be enough. We'll see what happens. Nick Bohr reporting live on Marquette's campus.